Hello everyone, this is Muhammad Muhammad from MMB Studios and today I'm going to be showing you the interface of Simfix Studio. I'm going to show you how to create an object using some of the tools and I'm going to show you how to save that project. Well, let's start with the interface. This is the working space. This is the working space panel. And this here, in the top left, is the toolbox panel. And this is the outline color and the fill color. This is the parameter panel. This down right here is the timeline panel. This is the layer panel. This is the tool option panel. And uh, this is the viewfinder. You can view, you can all right. Now this is the transformation tool, the smooth move tool, the scale tool, the rotate tool, the mirror tool, and all these five tools can be used after an object is created. First let's start by using this cycle tool to create an object. So an, our first object is created and as you can see this is the tool option. So you can set what you want. For example I want just a cycle layer. So you can add a region layer to it, you can add a outline layer to it, you can add an advanced outline layer to it. But for me I just want to use the cycle, create cycle layer. So you see our cycle has appeared in our layer panel and uh, our parameter panel has given us some more options we can tweak. So we can change the color. Let's change it to yellow. Close. So you see our cycle is now yellow. We can zoom the working space. And we can so let's select the transformation tool. And we can move the cycle by holding the green. And we can increase the size by holding the side. And uh, this is our spline tool this is a very useful tool too uh, so we're going to start with this uh, then you left click you left click again you left click and drag left click hold on to it and drag left click hold on to it and drag left click left click left click hold on to it and drag left click left click hold on to it and drag and now we right click you hold on right click and loops plane so let's select the transformation tool so you see it has appeared now in our layer panel this is the object we've just created using our spline tool so you can also move it by holding this green and change its color by double clicking and let's change it to blue and close so <clears throat> let's create a background let's select the rectangular tool left click and drag so now our, rect our rectangular tool has been created and as you can see it is the top layer here so we can drag it downwards and you can see it's a bit showing a bit of the check when it's showing the when it is showing the check, that means the that there is a transparent background. There is no background to it. And when you uncheck this, you have make it disappear from the working space, and you can make it appear again by checking it. Uh, then you can change the amount here in the amount panel uh, in the parameter panel. Sorry, make it one. Now. It is a solid color it is no longer transparent so to save your project there are some options here too you can create a new document open an existing document uh, this is the save document so you can set the name I will set mine to sample and I will save it in my documents and save i hope you enjoyed the video and if you do don't forget to subscribe 
like because i'm going to be uploading some more tutorial videos on simfix studio thank you very much